Welcome back, foul mouth fishing. Well, just got a nice surprise. Anticipated, very anticipated, not entirely expected uh, today, but uh, this just got dropped on the doorstep. Um, it was in the post that said it would be delivered by 9 p.m. today, so uh, yay! This is the June, not July, the June's. Anglers Hall Advanced. Um, obviously, with the pandemic and everything going on, things are all screwy when it comes to uh, to posting uh, products and shipments and uh, the supply chain to get things into their warehouse so they can ship things out to us. Uh, now, I'll be honest, I was anxious and uh, I caught a great reveal by uh, by a great YouTuber, uh, the Goondocks, over um, and I'll leave the description to his channel. Uh, down in the uh, in the description here, I'll leave the link. But uh, so I've already seen what, or at least I anticipate that I should have what he had in his advanced ticket. Or I should have in my advanced uh, box. But if you don't check out his uh, videos, you can check out this one, and I'll go through what Anglers Hall has to offer for June 2020. Um, if you don't know, Anglers Hall is another subscription carrier similar to things like Mystery Tackle Box. Uh, however, where Mystery Tackle Box stops, uh, where Monster Bass leaves off, um, that's where Angler's Hall fills that big void. And uh, basically what they supply you with isn't so much terminal tackle and baits, uh, soft plastic hard baits, etc. Although you will find them in these, in these uh, subscriptions month to month. What they actually offer you are all the utilities that you might need to go out fishing. Rods reels, um, uh, bait bags, bait backpacks, uh, storage facilities by Plano, by Groove Fishing. Um, you can go and look in the, in the library of all my past unboxings by Anglers Hall and you'll get a nice broad swath of what they have to offer, including apparel, uh, t-shirts, I got a boonie hat, um, I've gotten uh, sunglasses or, or you know, um, obviously uh, polarized sunglasses, fishing sunglasses. Great stuff, hats included. So uh, if you like what's in this video, I suggest you check out the other videos that I've posted on the Angler's Hall and continue to watch and, and follow me along as I continue to get these Angler's Hall month subscriptions. That being said, this is a, a long overdue uh, June box, but this is how this plays out. I'm going to set this down here. So there's two versions of Angler's Hall. You have what's called their Pro Tier, which is their standardized box, and then you have what they call their Advanced Tier, which is what I buy, which is a slightly higher price point. Um, what they do is everyone who orders an Angler's Hall Pro will get this selection of items for this month. If you pay more and get the Advanced Size um, box, then you will get these additional ad items added to the pro tier. So you'll get all the pro items plus these additions, and that boosts the overall value of your box uh, so that you're getting your money's worth, so to speak. So what they've got right off the bat, for $12.99, you have by WorkSharp. It is the WorkSharp Micro Sharpener. So let's, there's already a big thing in here. Woo. Let's see what I can dig out of this box. That's not it. That's not it. Alright, here we go. Micro sharpener and knife tool. Uh, portable two-stage knife tool sharpener Torx bit set. So there's Torx bits in the middle. So that's great for running the star uh, Torx uh, screws on your on your reels. 
Uh, sharpens knives and tools, ceramic diamond coated, has a Torx bit driver on the side. So we'll, uh, oh, I like this. It gives you a little demographic of how this works. There is the tool itself. Very compact, has a little uh, lanyard here that you can tie on to, you know, your pull tag of your bait bag or your tackle box. You need a knife to open the knife. So, let's see if I can open this up with as little to do as possible. Since I already cut myself today, I don't feel like cutting myself again. <laughs> All right. So, and there we go. So you've got this, uh, there's your diamond ceramic sharpening stone and a polishing stone on the other, a honing stone on this side. Um, you have your Torx bits in the middle. They just tip out. You can take your Torx bits out, and then it sits right here in this little hex, quarter-inch drive. And then you've got your, your little grips here for your thumb on this side and on this side. And you can obviously, as I drop the bit down there, there you go, snap it in place, now it won't fall out. Um, use that for your tension, and you can torque up what you need to torque up, fix what screws you need to fix. Convenient, stays right there. Um, again, there's that little lanyard to tie onto something. That's pretty darn nice. So you, you can come back, sharpen up your stone, hone it back down with this side. I like that. I, I always like a little compact um, ceramic knife sharpener. Um, this is also a very good tool for size and compact, uh, you know, size for sharpening your hooks. If you have larger hooks, um, you know, I wouldn't use this for size like 12 or size 14. Uh, hooks or, you know, but uh, for your 3 aught, 4 aught, um, you know, larger size hooks, um, that that's a, a really, really nifty tool. So I appreciate that. Again, $12.99 comes in all the boxes from Angler's Hall. For number two, we have a Plano KVD speed bag. So this is one of KVD's... Uh, Entrances into storage back in the day, one of the old style Plano. This is the uh, size 20 worm bag, which is cool because I do have a lot of soft plastic worms. Again, this is that nice water, you know, dry bag style wicking. You can pull these nice zips, and then you can keep your. Uh, your worms, your soft plastic worms in this bag here. Just throw all your packages or your soft plastics in here, zip it up, keeps it in a nice, easy, convenient location. Throw it down in the dry well in your boat or just throw it in your knapsack and it keeps them organized and dry and it's pretty expansive as you can see. Quite a few bags of soft plastics can fit in here. Again, this relies on you uh, keeping your soft plastics in their manufacturer's supplied um, packaging and just keeping it in here. Uh, when you keep deal with bags that have clamshells, um, you're going to get less product, obviously, because the clamshell is going to take up space, and this only expands a finite amount. However, if it doesn't have a clamshell, uh, you can lay this, this bag down, take your soft plastic worms, shake it until they're all nicely laid out, and then slip them in and just you know stack them nice and even and nice and tight, and you'll fit a far greater quantity of your plastic worms, or flukes for that matter. Um, but then again, you know, you have to be careful, store it in that direction so that you're not letting them all slump down and let gravity do its work because you don't want to twist up your worms, get them kinked, um, have the fluke tails, you know, destroyed and not run true. But uh, that's a little tidbit. As long as you store it in the same way, you pack them in the same way, you pull them out the same way, just like a file fax, um, that can hold slightly more quantity of baits uh, and keep them protected. That's, that's pretty cool. I appreciate that. I always like storage. I got way too many baits as a as a hookaholic <laughs> that uh, I need all the storage I can get. Um, that one is eleven dollars and ninety nine cents, and I think that's you know, an accurate price. It's not a newer item, and uh, you know, it's out on the market, been out on the market for quite a while. The KBD Speed Bag. Next, a T-shirt. So we got a Cryptek Aurora SS shirt. And that's this guy right here. Now, they've supplied quite a few uh, pieces of apparel, uh, some hats, some gloves, um, quite a few, uh, you know, moisture wicking products, a rain jacket, which has been very helpful to me. 
Uh, speaking of tomorrow, we're going to see a bunch of rain again. Uh, and a lot of these have been very cooling, so that's been helping in, this, in these 97, 98 degree days. And this one's right up there in that alley. So you can see this is a very see-through. It has that breathable back, so you don't get that back sweat uh, that nobody likes to get. Um, again, when you, when you order or when you, when you join the Angler's Hall, they're going to offer you a, a little survey and it asks you simple questions. Are your right hand or left hand dominant for retrieval? So when they do supply you with a reel, a, a bait casting reel, you can opt for a left hand retrieve or a right hand retrieve. Um, obviously with spinning, spinning gear, most times it's ambidextrous. You just swap out where the handle placement is. Um, but they also ask you what size shirt you are, what size shoes you wear, what size gloves you wear, you know, are you a medium, are you a 5'6", are you a size 10 shoe, um, you know, what have you. Um, and that's what they're going to ask you for. So that they can supply you with apparel that fits. So they're not just blanketing you like a lot of other tackle companies or, or mail orders that might just shell out extra large for everybody. You know, you might be a small, petite, young lady angler and, you know, uh, Monster Bass gives you an extra large or double XL t-shirt. What good is that to you? Um, so that's the one good thing that I have to say uh, that their trivia, their little you know questions actually do come true and they do stick to using the information you give them. It's not just a waste of time typing in the information to, uh, to supply them with that piece of uh, data so that they can ship you actual products that fit you. Uh, that is a $29.99 uh, Cryptek wicking shirt. That's cool. I'm definitely going to use that, especially like I said, we're having 90 degree days with the humidity through the roof where it feels like 105, 110, and it's just been unbearable. Uh, last in the pro tier for $7.99, bringing the pro tier's value of all these items for all the pro level purchasers to $62.96 total, the $7.99 Tackle HD Helger Mike. Again, they do supply baits occasionally. And Helger mites, if you don't know, are one of A Bass's sweets. It is their it is their cupcake, their chocolate cake, their their ice cream cone in the summertime. This is their all-time favorite snack is a Helger mite. You'll find these primarily hiding under rocks in uh, in larger uh, rivers and creeks uh, with good current. Uh, they're not predominant as much here in New Jersey, uh, but you go to Delaware, Pennsylvania, um, certainly down south, you can find Helger mites. They're the little nymph larvae of, I forget what, I forget off the top of my head what bug. Trivia question. Name the nymph larvae that the Helger mite turns into. Name what a Helger mite uh, becomes when it emerges. But these little guys hide under the rocks and uh, as you can see this one's got a nice soft but uh, but large body about probably I'd say about an inch and a half of soft plastic a solid core and then the remainder of the bait is this uh, corrugated thin very flexible material. So drop shot drop shot yeah that's gonna kick like crazy in the in the current and uh, when you're flicking it on a drop shot. Texas rigged Definite killer. Uh, weightless rigged on a, on a, you know, a small hook, this will hit them. This will hit them better than even a Senko worm. Um, you'd be surprised. The, the, just the, the overall shape, and if you have Helger mites in your waterways, the fish, won't. they can't resist these. Um, again, these are in Green Pumpkin. They're a 5-inch, 10-pack, full package of Helger mites, and I'm definitely going to have fun getting some use out of these on some of the backwater creeks that I fish for some small and largemouth bass. They love these things. If you if you know of real Helger mites and you have them, watch out for those pincers. They'll get you. They'll bite the crap out of you. So be wary of the real deal. So a soft plastic rendition is a definite welcome, uh, welcome addition to my tackle bag because I don't like having a little pouch on the side and having to finagle to pick one out and put it on the hook when it gets me by the thumb or by the forefinger. That ain't fun. All right, next up, for, for participants like myself who go to the next step tier, um, it is a pricey, pricey purchase. This isn't like uh, Mystery Tackle Box for $30 or $40 a month. This is $110, $109 per month for this package. But again, you get things like tools, 
high quality apparel. Uh, Plano Real Locker. This, this is something I've, I'm definitely going to find use for. It is a hard pack, hard case, soft nylon sided, and very versatile and fully adjustable real storage case. Now, this is something I didn't even know Plano put out, but by golly, it's something I've probably needed for going on 15 years. I've got reels at the yin yang that might not have rods to go with them. I've got rods that might not have reels to go with them because you're not going to put a size 6000 reel on an ultralights, uh, you know, rod. So for your bait casters, or for that matter, for your spinning tackle, you've got a nice foam padded top, uh, uh, well protected bottom, and fully adjustable with these Velcro inserts that you can actually adjust nearly anywhere because the entire side lining is the, the loop, and then these inserts have the hook for the hook and loop. So you can have a tiny little itty bitty micro thing, or, and this is where my brain plays tricks, because these are fully adjustable, I can keep spools of line, my 20 pound test mono, my 15 pound test fluoro, right here in this reel locker with the space for the bait caster that I use that reel or that, uh, that mono or that uh, fluorocarbon or that braid on. So take the, the reel out of, 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 of uh, fishing line out of your box, throw it in here, put your reel right next to it, and when you need to change it out at the end of the season, there you go. Reels that you don't have on rods currently or you want to keep on the side for emergency cases or backups or, you know, uh, species-specific reels because of the way that they have, you know, their designed um, drag or just basically your your private stash of reels and and that's that's what this is for storing them away keeping them safe keeping them dry keeping them uh, away from dust after your season when you've oiled and greased them up and you put them away for the winter because you're going to go out ice fishing all your summer tackle reels can go in here and be kept safe and secure and zipped up and protected completely by this nice little reel locker so for that, I am very, very, very happy. It comes with not only a nice carrying handle, but a shoulder strap to boot. Also, if you do a lot of uh, travel um, and you do take quite a few rods and reels, you can ship out your, you know, your rods to your travel destination uh, down in the storage hole, and you can keep your expensive, you know, um, yeah, you know, bait casting reels, your expensive saltwater tackle reels in this and bring this as your carry-on because it's obviously compact enough to fit in the overhead. So uh, that, again, lots of ideas, lots of potential, Plano, way to go. That one right there, that added $79.99 for that product retailed. Last on the, uh, in this, this June's shipment is something that's eh, but uh, it's overpriced, but all of these are overpriced and it will have its benefits. High bright light, H Y B R I D L I G H T, hybrid light navigational headlamp. So for $34.99, what you have is a baseball cap clip on headlamp. So it comes with the head strap, as you can see all right there. It comes with the little head strap that you can put it around your, your head. Or without the head strap, you can clip it. Oh no, it doesn't come with a head strap, that's just a clip. Sorry. So it comes with a clip. I thought that was a head strap in there, but that's just a plastic clip uh, with the foam core to protect your bill or your hat. And uh, you just clip this on to the brim of your baseball cap and you can uh, adjust it up and down so that you can train your light outward or train your line down uh, so that you can see what you're doing. Easy on and off click switch. Comes with your white light, comes with a dimmer switch. So you have your high, your low. Also comes with a red light somewhere in here, I'm pretty sure. 99% sure it comes with red light. And the reason for the red light is during night fishing, your eyes actually adjust better with 
a red light than they would with the bright white. Five hours of light, three LED colors, white, red, and green. So it, has a, it also has a green light, too. So the in the military, um, going way back for centuries, actually, for well, for multiple generations in my family, uh, we've always had the old-fashioned military gooseneck uh, flashlights, and we've always had the red filters for night vision so that your eyes aren't strained, and they can train themselves off of light when you shut it off back to dark vision so you, you're not basically blind for a period of time. You can almost instantaneously continue to have that a visual uh, cue to see things in the dark even after you've turned off the light when you're out camping and whatnot. So that's pretty nifty. So I appreciate it. And the fact that it comes with the three colors, um, it's not just a straight on off black or on off white light. It comes with the green and the red and it has a high low setting. Um, I'm going to say that's, yeah, that's worth the $35, $34.99. If it was just strictly your standard on off, even on off high low, uh, it'd be like a $10, $15 light. Um, but I'll give them the extra, the double the price because it, it does come with that, that, uh, added advantage. So total value of what I purchased, $109. I got $177.94 retail value. So I made, you know, about 65, 70 bucks on the purchase of my of my price and I will say for all the things in here uh, I'm gonna say the that storage locker and the Helger mites and the you know the Plano the, or not the Plano speed bag but the works sharpener um, those three items alone to me were worth the investment uh, so that I'm hoping uh, you know you understand and you like as my doorbell rings um, if you like this, like, subscribe, and share. And uh, as always, from me to you, tight lines, peace, and I'll catch you on the next cast. Thanks, Hookaholics.